Hello everybody, welcome back to the mini project. Alright, today we are doing radiator, water pump, fan belt, thermostat. And uh, yeah, we've got lots of uh, goodies down here. Plus we've got new HT leads, new coil, not can oh my god, another day. Another distributor cap. We've got hoses, we've got radiator, brand new radiator. We've got lots of bits and pieces to put on. We still got a few things waiting to turn up. We've had a few more things come today. We've had all the switch and the relay and the wiring come to do the spotlights, the proper spotlights we're putting on. Uh, we've had the bonnet straps turn up yesterday. So we're just uh, gonna be prodding along doing a job on it day by day by the looks of it. And watch him uh, maybe kill himself doing stuff so yeah we're uh, you. lovely jolly give me access to all this wiring spaghetti junction in the distributor cap still trying to find this draining clip in I thought they had a draining plug underneath the radiator Feel that. I thought there was one. Oh well. It looks like it's been leaking at some point anyway, because it's like a lot of brain stains down there. So it did definitely needs replacing anyway. But yeah. Yeah. It seems all pretty solid, all bus. See what I mean about the tape? I mean, look, look, it's just, look, they've, like, I don't know what they've done, they just made a mess of it all, so I need, I need all tidying up. So, right. Oh, crack on, I got the team out here with me today. The, I don't know about A team, I got the B team, I think. There's one, look, look at him, look, miserable. Look. What are you looking over there for? They're talking to you. Mr. Happy Harry there. Tom Cruise. Right, so let's crack on and get something done. Let's set this thing up somewhere along the line. That's where it's starting. I mean, it's like all this is all, it's, even though it's only a breather, it's poorly done. I mean, you can see it's got a crack in it and they put tape around it, so it's, I mean, it's quite poorly done. So, all that I need replacing. So, it's just undo everything in sight, I reckon. I mean the hose, you can see it's all cracked from there, not in very good condition, so yeah. Right. Not very clean in there, so it needs a good flush through. So. Right, let's get on and get something done. Do you want to see that? So that's almost my half yet. Yeah, Start by like flooding yourself out with water, I think. Never done a radiator on a mini. All the years being in like motor track. Never ever worked on a mini like this. I've done floor pans in a mini, put new floor in, new seals. I've never had to work on the engine. Oh, if you keep them, you can remember. So don't get the new ones come with any clips. No, they don't. But I have got the new ones on there. A little bit on the long side in here. Yeah. Start somewhere on the line.
say you want it rough as well, give it a clean up as well to get on the pit and so on. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's just like you said, that. <laughs> so yeah, it's just wires everywhere. I mean, I know that one's important, but I mean, it's just the way they fed it all through everywhere. I like how I'm stuck doing it all again. Should be you doing it. Can you get in there? No, I'm not going to get in there. That's where I've got to find those fun, isn't it? Oh, for God's sake. Never know, it might be another parcel for you. No, that the Royal Melbourne, he just decides to bump up on the grass now wherever he feels like. <laughs> First moved here, there was only a couple of us who had a car in the street. Mm -hmm. and everybody in the street saw the car. Thing I do is just cut the belt off. No, it'll come off in I just didn't know. No, it's not like a can belt. You need to just cut them if you want to. So, I mean, look at this, look, look, look. Look at this. This metal bracket here, look. That's from the old orn. Just stuck there. I don't know what I'm going to be doing today, isn't it? That's what I'm always wearing in my And it's like all this. I mean, it's not even fitted in properly, is it? Yeah. It's literally just more and more. Uh, more of those just um, bodged in oh. screws. Oh. Now we're ready to work on this one, isn't it? Put the tools in there. to get me motivated. <laughs> Let's 
gemacht das war. Today's been a pain in the ass, but it's not as well. Alright, I could do with a good clean. That looks really, really gunky. Mm -hmm. It's good that I took that grow out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright, there's your uh, thing to do. Alright, now I see what holds the uh, radiator in, because I was wondering what was the radiator in. I can't. Seem to fill anywhere where you can drain the radiator. I thought there was a draining plug on it. That's the sign saying no process use. Yeah. I've just got to wait for the normal postman to come. Then we already had a Royal Mail van come round today. Do you want me to get an umbrella light? Mm -hmm. You know, a nice comfy chair, deck chair, margarita to drink or something like that. You know? Happy Harry today, aren't you? <sighs> oh, it's like, where would you start, isn't it? Yeah, just start taking things apart. No, I like how you say just start taking things apart. I don't know what you're like when you took things apart. Old that old reverb that I asked you to take apart from me. Ended up with half a dozen screws. And the dashboard still didn't come out. Oh, I'll take things off and I'll paint it anyway. Like that alternator, that's going to need a good clean out. Definitely, I've been in warm one today. Yeah, that's where I thought I'd start doing this today. Right, we're going to use up loads of footage and loads of memory. So, this is what I'm undoing, everybody. I'm undoing this. And uh, there's a hose down there, which I'm going to get flooded out once I start taking this radiator out. So, we'll come back to you once we get the radiator out. So, just out for a bit. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Okay, we've got the radiator out, youngins. Taking the fan off because we've got to change the water pump as well. And uh, there's the radiator over here. As you can see, it's, it's seen better days. It sees all the hoses and stuff like that, so it didn't look much cock. So I thought let's um, change it. Oh, and we had to take to get everything, we had to take this bracket off which I've never seen one of these before on a mini so obviously that's something been added all right you've got a fan off so we're getting extra bits and pieces there's your uh, fan oh. belt <laughs> and uh, remember all these bits and pieces mine and then we just got to get this off of the off of there which is going to be tight that's going to be, I might have to put a puller on that actually, or I might have to heat it up and hopefully tap it off, because the water pump is shot anyway. Well, it's not leaking I don't think, but it's been on there a long time, yeah. So, but apart from that, it's in pretty good nick this little car. So, like I said, I've got all this wiring, like somebody's and they've got tape in and it's just looks a mess and uh, sort all that out for them so and just give it a good clean and I'll crack on with it I suppose right we'll come back to you once we've moved this pulley and we'll start on this water pump and we might film 
taking it off. We might film not taking it off because we might snap a few bolts and there'd be a lot of nasty words being said. So I don't know not to film it or not. But um let's sort some out. Anyway, we'll come back in a little bit. Do you have a I do, yeah. yeah Hello everybody, welcome back. Okay, I've left okay. Young to do this. So if he snaps them on his head be it. That's it, just little little nips at a time. Right, go to the next one. Don't I do don't, don't undo any more, just go to the next one. I need the smaller one for these two. Alright. What size was it? Eleven on it. Yeah. Alright, don't break this ratchet because it's only a small little ratchet. Only a little tiny little thing. That's it. A little bit at a time. Right, go on to the next one, whatever he is. Is that all of them now? Mm -hmm. Apart from that pipe, we've got to be undone as well. So leave them in for a minute and do that pipe if you can. You need a screwdriver for that. Very Try that one. Don't kill me screwdrivers. That's the one everybody hates doing, I think. Yeah, no. Got a little muck in there. Is it more of a smaller flat yeah, rail? I think it's probably a thinner one. Probably got that much fucking muck, uh, that much muck in it as well. Try that one. Just don't break the head on the screw. They are a pain in the ass, these ones are. Might have to just uh, saw the top of it off on the uh, clip. Might have to just saw the clip off just here so we can just break it off. Yeah. They're not coming off, I don't think. No, they're on there good. They've been rusted on there for a while. Yeah. Okay. Right. Hey, we have a couple of cats having a scrap. Oh, look at that. Lovely. Cat scrap. <laughs> okay everybody we're going to come back once uh we've got this little clip off because it's just wasting up footage you've seen what we got to do we got to get that annoying thing off down there so i'll come back in a little bit hello again everybody welcome back okay we've got the water pump out we've got that hose up they've took the water pump out at the moment because they've got to get a new hose we find the hose had a little tiny split in it and that's the reasons why We've seen all that corrosion around the water pump because it had been leaking for quite some time. Unfortunately, we bought a new water pump and it arrived well a couple of days ago, but unfortunately, it's the wrong one. The outlet, oh god, saying the outlet just here has been blocked. I did say the young one, I could just file that edge off there and then drill through it, but he said, Oh no, I'll just pop up the car shop, I'll go and get another one. It's 17 quid, so that one either be up for sale or. Or we'll, um, we'll just keep it on the shelf for a later date for something else. But yeah, so there's all that to do. There's all this bits of cleaning up to do. So I'm just going to clean all the muck off of here and give it a make it look a little bit more better. Um, I was going to clean all the muck off this side of the engine and give it. A a little bit of paint but I think it's just a waste of time it looks pretty reasonable so I think I might just uh, clean the thermostat hosing off properly so that's already in the water pump all cleaned off all the bolts came out none of them snapped so I'm pleased with that because I let young and do that so they um, they're all in there somewhere so a couple of them were a bit on the rusty side 
Uh, this one, very, very rusty. So I've got to clean all the threads up. Um, and then I might heat, heat them up and then stick them in some oil, oil afterwards to strengthen them up a bit. Or um, just clean the threads up and just put a bit of grease on them and then shove them back in. Um, yeah, so as I said, I had to remove this. I've never seen one of these before. Obviously, this is an added extra because I've never, never, I don't know, must be some sort of stabilizer for the added extra, I suppose, because it looks too shiny. It doesn't look like it's original. Like I said, I don't know much about minis. I had a mini long, 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 long time ago when I was really young, and um, I didn't have to ever work on the engine. All I had to do was put new floor pans in it, new new outer skin seals and I uh, had to weld all the boot up because it was a piece of crap but uh, yeah so and that and the fact I had to do the drum brakes because they were you know what it's like with drum brakes are a pain and pissing ass farting around doing them uh, yeah so we're getting little jobs done on it we've still got a few items left to come through for the post but um like I said we had all new um all new straps, bonnet straps, um, other bits and pieces of rope. So, we, like I said, young and bought another set of these, but unfortunately, uh, he bought them for the spotlights and they're the wrong size. I did try and tell him, but he, being young, you know what they're like when they're young. Uh, but still, you've got to learn by your mistakes. That's the only way of doing it. You learn by your mistakes, especially when you're young. So, I said we put the bumper back on for now while well, young and put the bumper back on for now and um, just going from there really we got like I said we got a nice spotlight bracket to go on there properly proper one I think he paid about I think it was about hundred pound with the spotlights and everything from a mini mini specialist so what I'm gonna do at the moment is just clean the little bits of rust off of there off that timing case cover clean that up a little bit and then I'm just gonna go and get me snips and a knife and start sorting out this electrics and tape up what we don't need need anymore uh, or I might just leave it for a minute because I know he wants the spotlights wired in so I've been then I probably got to do it all again so I don't know it's, it's like one of those things isn't it where'd you start <laughs> oh dear I mean you just buy stuff and then you want to add to it and add to it I mean in the couple of weeks he's had this little mini I've, it's brought back a lot of memories for me and um, I'm quite tempted to get myself another mini quite tempted I wanted a Morris Minor or a Maxi or a Marina Coupe I know you're all probably saying what the hell do you want a Marina for but I I quite like the Marina I quite like the Coupe a TC would be nice but they're probably hard to find now I expect it's probably hard to find even a marina now they're getting hard, hard well, all these cars are getting hard to find um, but I gotta sell the I gotta sell my Rover P6 first anyway um, that needs to be sold so like I said all the tires were done on it it's a bit dirty all down the side with the rain what we've had we've had severe torrential rain um, yeah she starts up on the button start motor sticks now and then but I think it would free up once it starts being used but we were going to use it for the wedding for this year but the wedding's been cancelled so I think I'd be better off just selling it to be honest truthful so I shan't need it now I'm not getting married until next year now so I might um, just sell it on it's just the bodywork what needs doing really there's no welding to be done on it it's never ever been welded underneath anyway it's had the odd little patch put here and there but nothing underneath it's absolutely solid underneath so I thought if I can try and sell it the last job what I needed doing with the tires I've put all decent tires on there so they're all done I've got Pirelli's on the back and I um, can't think what's on the front but there is all the tires are done anyway it's just uh, there's lots of spares to go with it as well if I get the right offer but, um, I'm not giving it away because uh, it stands me in at over three thousand pound doing the car up, buying the car and doing the car up to get it to actually to its starts runs. 
I mean nearly everything underneath the bonnet is a brand new so that's where all my money went was underneath the bonnet doing all the mechanical side of it um, there's new discs all around there's new calipers all around so if anybody's interested in a Raver P6 2.2 single carb leave me a message and um, yeah because I would like to like I said just sell it really because like if not it's just going to sit there for another year I mean it was meant to be for the wedding this year that's the reason why I was rushing to get it done but now the wedding's been cancelled until next year it's, it's going to be sat there for a year so I might as well just sell it and I'll use one of the other cars I got for a wedding so yeah which is a bit of a shame but I wouldn't mind either a, a, a mini actually or a maxi or a marina I just fancy something different I've had all the Ford Capris, I've had all the Cortinas, I've had Ganadas and then again if it came to a Ganada I'd have a Mark 1 Ganada um, but yeah so I'm going to crack on and get some more little jobs done on this little mini and I'll come back in a small little while whilst the young'uns have gone to get a new water pump and um, like I said we've got lots and lots of brand new goodies down in there there's all the hoses and stuff in there so and we've got new thermostat to go in and whatnot so I'll uh, clean this alternator up and give that a clean I think actually that give me something to do while they're gone down the road so I don't know how long they're going to be so I'll come back in a short while bye bye for now hello everybody right I've given this a clean giving the top a clean Young Un's back now with some more bits and pieces. We've got the correct water pump. Uh, he's cleaning up all the rusty bits. I've cleaned up the alternator. So we've got the new water pump. That's in the camera. Um, we have the correct hose, so they cut us a piece and uh, just got to join it. It comes with the gaskets in there. So we've got the new water pump. So that's that, the old one's in the bag. Antifreeze and stealth water. So, so he's just having fun cleaning. Getting all the mucky every 30 years of grime off of it all. So I've got all soaking in there and paraffin. Fan. Yellow fans cleaning up a little bit, all the grime's coming off. Now it's been soaking in paraffin. So the two boys can clean up all that crap and one can do a bit of spraying when I can, rattle cans. The alternator like I said has just been cleaned off with a wire brush, nothing fancy, just a quick clean. But, uh, yeah, so we've got so we're getting there, it's just uh, a long slow day today. What let us down was the fact is we picked up the wrong water pump and young and wouldn't let me drill it out which I reckon I could have just drilled it out and what not but he wanted to assist it on going and get the uh, a new one so for the sake of I don't know how much it was 17 quid I suppose I suppose it was well worth it so yeah I let him go and get it so we'll put that one on the shelf if not we'll see if anybody wants to buy it yeah so about it for the moment really it's not much I can tell you all I can do is rub it on and I can certainly do that for you uh, yeah so I'm just gonna let him clean all that up I'm gonna get the youngest one out to do a bit of cleaning as well because time's getting on and um, I'm gonna try and get it all back together I mean we've got the heater in there which has got to go back in the car as well so right I'll come back in a short while Next shot. Right, young uns over there, he's spraying. Why is that a silver, Liam? That's not a primer. So you need the primer. Yeah, you just shook up silver. No, no, it's all right. I'm actually going to film that. Dead giveaway when it says silver on top of the lid. You could have had a silver pulley. So give it a good shake. Well, yeah, it's inside, so you know that's in there. All right, he's doing that. He's cleaning up that. 
I cleaned up load of nuts and bolts to go back on the thermostat housing and the water pump. So these are all being cleaned up the best I can. So I'm just going to coat them in grease and stick them in with the water pump. Yeah, so he's actually now fan of grey. I've actually found some new Jubilee clips for this bit of pipe and that can now follow with me. So I'm going to have fun fitting this. He's, they're all doing that so it gives them something to do. So they're at my air for a bit. Right, so I'm going to fit this because like I said that, that wall over there is no good. That's no rubbish. So, so this has all been cleaned up best we can on the inside there and there so I am now going to go and get a little bit of sealant to go around uh, most people don't bother but sometimes it's always best to put an extra bit of sealant around but, uh, yeah we got, we got new clips and just a bit of pipe because the old pipe was shot so, like I said they're busy doing that a little bit of pain, let's see how he's getting on. Yeah, that's probably enough in there actually. I'll let that dry on that outside and then do that in a bit after. You've got another can down there, haven't you? Oh. Change the nozzle. Change the nozzle, take the nozzle off. Take the nozzle off of that one, put on there. And then give the can a good shake. Right, I'll come back in a short while once uh, I start getting ready. I know it's in and out, in and out, and you're not really seeing any progress going, just watching these two, Bill and Ben over there, carrying on. So they're at cat and mouse at the moment. Right, I'll be back in a bit. Right, hello everybody. I'm sure, uh, sorry I haven't really been filming, 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 but we've had nothing but little e-cups and problems, and God knows what, the water pump is on. We've got the hose on. And then the other problem was, down here on this fan as you can see I've had to put allen key bolts because that's all I could find at the time and they're stainless steel so they're not going to rust so he's had this expensive stuff put on this car so we're trying to do the radiator now and then we find out uh, what happened was the bolts for that wouldn't screw into the water pump and it's the same with this we went to put these bolts in here and those won't even screw in neither so I presume what I got here oop, will do it. No. You hold that a minute. Too big a washer. Uh, these threads are either too long, these bolts I mean. So the case of either grinding the bolt down, I'll pack out just with a few washers. These are stainless steel washers, so they ain't gonna rust. A little bit of a bodge, but just for a couple of washers. No differences in there. sit there for hours grinding these bolts down but just just for the sake of what just an extra washer oh, an extra two washers that's all just that little bit long <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, 
Sneezers. It's like pink fumes a minute ago, aren't the news? Yes, you could say biggest part of most of all the bolts on this thing we've had to improvise and find other things to do. Those Allen key bolts I've just put in now, for some reason the thread on the water pump was slightly different. So these are now obsolete with the rest of the stuff. That's that. Oh yeah, this little thing. That's got to go on. There. Like so. Goes in there like that. Goes in there like that. Sort of paint. Did you want to put that top hose now as well? Whilst we we're down here. No, I'll leave that to last. Yeah. Show the front of that. Make sure you worry about that. Right. So that's that done. I've got to get back up now, my knees. Oh. It's one that long bloody bugger again, that's that one there. And the washer's fell in there now as well, isn't it? There he is, I see him. jobs where you do sum up and look after it and think, oh, why have I got all these extra screws? Just muggins here, had the lady just putting a stainless steel in the nuts and bolts. Right, let's see if this bloody thing fits. <coughs> I don't even know how it wiggles back in. I don't even know how we wiggled it out. We wiggled it out. And we've got to wiggle it back in. Is that how high it sat originally, was it? Seems that way, doesn't it? Right, that's that bit done. Right, now we've got to fight to get this hose on. And you've got to fight this in the bloody way. See what I'm bloody doing. Let's undo that clip a bit now. Let's see how tight that clip was with. It's probably why it's all there. That's probably enough, otherwise, it's going to come out. It's alright, it'll come off. I've got no way to fall to, is it? You don't. 
<laughs> and even now, I still got under that a little bit more. I'll watch now is when this is on that's not gonna rub on there that's what I'm worried about in case that rubs on there I think it should be all right can you not take it to the top but then no. I guess you won't be able to get the fucking screw, uh, screwdriver in there should be all right there we'll nip it up a little bit and I'll see what it's like So what I'm worried about is well now you'd be alright no, once that's cleared. Uh, once that's pulled that's fine. Right, let's get the bigger screwdriver. <laughs> let's get my big boy on it. Yeah, you got another bracket to go on there yet, man. Ah uh, yeah, true. All my new stainless steel, all my new clamps. Yeah, that's just churning now. Right, that ain't going anywhere. Like right, I said, one last pull, you ain't gonna see that. Right, that one, I gotta find a clamp now for that one. I could use the old one, should we? This is for the heater. Which that's still got to be done. Yeah. The little bodge what we done inside out. Then put the heater matrix in, I guess, is it? Yeah. When you take your bodge off, does that will that probably have water sat in it? Yeah. Yeah. It's better off taking the carpet back out because there's only resting in there. And then whatever goes on the floor just gonna put up. Okay, that's that one done. That's so I'll do this one at a later date. That's nothing to do with the heater at the moment. But I don't like I don't like bodges like that. Right, where's the um thermostat? In the car. In the gasket and whatnot. So that let see a bit of footage. So all we've done at the wall, all I've done at the moment is wrap it in. Doing the fuel thing today, or? Have you seen the tank? Mm. Gone round quick, see? When I said to you, um, Liam, spray that silver, I didn't realise it was a chrome silver. <laughs> <laughs> you got a bit of bling. We got a bit of bling. 
very shiny. <laughs> it is very shiny, isn't it? Right. Now I've got to put that stupid bracket on first because that's got to sit on the top of it. But I think, where's that bracket? I think it only sat on two of those things, didn't it? Two of the bolts. Yeah, the two. Yeah, sat like that. Two of the bolts, so I can put one in. So they all should be greased up. <laughs> Covered in the mark. The size was out. There you go. 13, I think, yeah. I don't even know why I tried that one yet. <laughs> that was really shit. What was it then? 12? 11? I think it was an 11, wasn't it? What was the one I was using? Yeah, 11. What was the one I was using a minute ago? That was 11. Even mm, you said 8. Oh, was that 8, wasn't it? Somehow, it sits behind that stupid bloody thing there, won't it? Yeah. I don't know how. Oh, anybody? Thought with that, I don't know. I don't think that was behind it. No, I don't think that was behind it. How oh, bloody hell did this go there? That was out of the way. That must have went under there then like that. That's why I said this. I don't think this is a standard piece. This is something somebody's added. You got that nut there, yeah. Yeah, it. Come on. Shit. my hammer out in a minute. <laughs> it's almost there. Where is it? You're literally near enough right on it. There you go. It's not even bloody on yet. Bloody hell. Did I have deep? How did I get this off? I don't know. I think you just kept yanking at it. Oh, I bent it back on the screen. Oh my god. Let's get that big bar in. Big bar, big lever screwdriver. There, there you go. go. And then you just gotta try and get that one nut over it. And then it's the same again as last time is Alright, let's get them in there first. Always out anyway. Yeah, so. That one has fell out. You're uh, gonna have fun and games trying to get them back in as well, aren't you? I'll find that nut for that. I 
Yeah, we'll do that one. Up. Let me get a spot and do that one. Mm -hmm. Those won't tighten them down in a minute. I should do that. Let's get this rubbish all done. Uh, right, nuts for that and the washers for that, won't it? I suppose. So should we pause this and come back to it later? Yeah, we just showed them what we're doing. So. Okay, we film them. Yep. Right, we've done that. That's been a nightmare. It's under the dash. Let's do what? Oh. I think I might go and get some new clips out to JD. Look at that, look. <laughs> Show everybody. Look. look at that. That's the old clips that came off the car. This is a new, a new hose. Look at that. There's like 50 dozen turns. Right. What's the next job I need to do? Put that bracket on. I'll do that in a minute. Get some new Add it. Add it. Don't rinse it too much. I want to snap like you did the bumper. Right. That's that and that. Let's get the let's get this hose on. Don't take that. That's a flipping hose now. Can I put that around? What is it with everything on this car? Because you've modified it and nothing to fix. But I gotta undo that clamp first, don't I? So this is what happens, see, I'm getting tired and knackered. Been on it all day, hanging nuts, bolts, screws. Absolutely all right now. Oh dear. That is gonna be one of a bend, isn't it? This doesn't not look. This doesn't look right. No, it doesn't look right. 
Something does not look right. That's too, that's too far over. I'm starting to wonder now if, because I can't remember now, we're like looking at footage. I wonder if you came around a bit more. It just doesn't, it just doesn't look right. Let's get on that one first. It just doesn't look right. It might be just been me. I really don't know, but I'm sure. That doesn't look right. Mm, the bottom in on. Yeah, the bottom in on. I know. See, that is too much of a kink. It needs trimming a bit then. And that's what I'm wondering. It just does not seem right. Because obviously that would have been originally for the... Have you got your phone on you? For the normal uh, one. No, yeah. that's all the way I wanted to see and He's I'll check, got his on him. check the old footage and see where this is. Because I'm, I'm, I'm starting to wonder if I put this on too close this way. Makes you wonder if it's meant to go around that way a bit more. Because that just does not seem right. right. See, I, 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 I don't know. It just does not, unless it just needs cutting down. But I want to check that footage first. Come back in a minute, Liam. Shut it down for a minute. Right, hello everybody. I am absolutely cream crackered now. I'm all right today. Uh, right, that's on. I'm not happy with this kink in there. But this is the hose they bought, so I'm just not happy with that kink. I don't know if it's just me being fussy, but I'm just not happy with that kink. I don't know. I'm just not sure. Um, when we looked at the old hose, where's the old hose gone there? There it is. See the old, old hose. So. Yeah, because that's the way you must have took off, because if it was up there, it would have been all wet there. So, it's definitely in the right place, that, from the side, from that hose, anyway. Uh, yeah. So, it's just uh, a little bit out of time, a little bit out of time. So, I'll finish off tomorrow, because I've got to put the alternator on. The, what else has got to go on? The heater matrix got to go back in. And, um... Some other bits and pieces got to be done on it yet, but yeah, apart from that, it's getting there. It's uh, I'll keep it up on the ramps because uh, it's nice and higher up here to work on than being down on the deck and bending over, bending your back. So, just one thing after another at the moment. So, we're just uh, clearing up, clearing up the car, tidying it up. Um, Putting the uh, the other bits back in the car for a minute, just resting it in the in the boot or in the floor of the car. But yeah, I'll finish it off tomorrow, so there'll be more work to be done tomorrow. Uh, it's just took the day today. I mean, they had to shoot off to go and get a water pump, so that took quite a while today. <gasps> oh, pardon me. Uh, yeah, so that took a while today. Uh, uh, just in case of, oh, excuse me, I'm very really tired. I am cream cracker, a bit wore out. And we've got a few few things to uh, still content with. I'm just wrapping it in all now. So I'm going to call it a day because, um, like I said, I'm cream cracker. But I'm absolutely wore out. Um, so all the best to everybody. Thank you for your comments. Thank you for subscribing. And um, let's see if we can get to, well, let's see if we can get to 200 subscribers because it'd be nice if we could get to that in a matter of a couple of days time that would be brilliant because like thank you for everybody supporting us on this on these projects like the mini the rover the jag the lada all sorts 
and uh, well, hopefully we'll keep on coming with some more videos for you. So, ta-ta for now. Bye-bye.